Here's some exciting news from Tesla. Tesla is going to make a Tesla pickup truck. What does this mean for the pickup truck industry? In a message on Twitter late Tuesday, Musk said, I promise that we'll make a pickup truck right after the Model Y. And the Model Y, as you guys know, is an electric SUV that's due to release in about two years. According to Musk, this Tesla pickup truck is going to be competing with the Ford F-150, that full-size truck niche, which is one of the most profitable niches in the marketplace. They sell many of these pickup trucks everywhere, and this could be a great thing for a lot of people. Because, you know, the uh, F-150s do not get great gas mileage, and they're not really particularly powerful. Musk really teased the pickup truck during the semi-truck unveiling, which was, he brought out a pickup truck out of one of the semis, and that thing looked massive. So I think he's planning on uh, making a pickup truck that's bigger than the F-150. Musk also said, in terms of size, that it will be comparable to Ford's 150 for total size, but quote unquote, maybe slightly bigger to account for a really game changing feature I'd like to add, end of quote. I'm not quite sure what this feature he plans on adding, but if it's a, a pickup truck, I would imagine that this feature needs to be something that will help towing or work or something like that. Um, it, it is pretty interesting to even speculate on what this feature could be. But I think maybe he's just kind of talking to kind of get the buzz going. Musk also said in a tweet that, quote, I promise that we'll make a pickup truck right after the Model Y. Have had a core design engineering element in my mind for almost five years, and I'm dying to build it, end of quote. This was said on December 26, 2017. So the Model Y is expected to be in production in 2020. So I, do, I would imagine after that, it would be this pickup truck would be start being built. But since uh, Musk is unable to really fulfill the Model 3 production, it, you know it's pretty amazing that he just comes up with new ideas without filling in the production for his current vehicles. So one of the few things that uh, Musk said about the building of this pickup truck. So he said, I am quite keen on building a truck and I think there's a lot one can do with truck technology. One of the things that I think should be present in trucks is something like air suspension that dynamically adjusts the load and sort of keeps the angle of the truck correct and the ride height even and adjust the dampening in real time. So because of the challenge you have with any vehicle where there's a big potential difference between the minimum and maximum load is that the suspension is always wrong and usually wrong by a lot. I was driving an F-250 down the 405 one day and honestly that thing, it was resonating on 415 on the little ridges. I thought my teeth were going to rattle out of my head. If you put a load on it, it's fine, but if you're empty, it's not. It would be good to do that, and obviously to make it light and handle really well. That's where having a battery pack low can improve the center of gravity. I think it's possible to produce a really well handling truck that feels good at any load point. That would be really great. So with that, we can kind of understand the technology that he's thinking, that the technology would automatically compensate for the load in the truck. And from having driven many pickup trucks and with varying loads capacity, it is very true that pickup trucks do feel very different with different loads on the back. You know, an F-250 Super Duty completely empty does bounce you around a lot on the highway. It's meant to be pretty loaded. And it, it does have air suspension in the back, the F-350 that I own and you can kind of um, put air in it depending on the loads and stuff like that. But it would be nice if it was automatically compensated because, you know, that is an extra step that you have to do to make sure that the truck is properly adjusted. So now you've heard a little bit about the Tesla pickup truck, and I believe after the buzz of the Model 3 dies down, 
this pickup truck will probably be the next big thing for Tesla.